Today I want to talk about something that I believe has probably affected all of us on this fast at one time or another, and that's feelings of shame. The enemy loves to heap it on us. He wants us to feel condemnation so that we don't go to God in freedom. Personally, I've been battling this on the fast. I haven't been able to spend the time in God's Word and in prayer that I'd hoped. It hasn't been as consistent or as long as I would have liked, and so I feel badly about that. I feel disappointed in myself. But the Lord is reminding me, and I believe He may want to remind you, if you've been struggling, that there's no condemnation. He loves us, and His love is never based on our performance. The Bible says there is no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. That's Romans 8.1. So if we are in Christ, we're never out of Christ. Once we've been saved, born again, justified, we're secure in the Lord. The Bible says that no one, nothing can snatch us out of God's hands. Once we've been adopted, we're His forever. And that's a wonderful, comforting truth. And so I want to encourage you today, if you are struggling with some of these feelings of shame, whether it's things that the enemy is bringing up to remind you of your past mistakes or disappointments on this fast, let's focus on what God says. There's no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. Nothing can separate us from His love. And we are more than conquerors through Him who loves us. That's all from Romans 8. So if you really need encouragement, go read that whole chapter. It's wonderful. Well, I am praying for you, and I am just believing that God is doing great things in your life and in the lives of those around you. So keep pressing on and keep looking to the Lord. He is faithful. Have a wonderful day 13. I'll see you soon.